欢迎大家收听收睇我哋探中和商机呢个节目，我系你哋嘅主持人 Judy。我哋嘅节目呢系中英对照嘅，第一部分呢就系用广东话同大家分享，而第二部分呢就系用英文咧将个稿读出嚟噶。咁我哋今日。呢、这个节目呢，仍然系讲人工智能喺电力市场嘅应用。咁人工智能喺呢个电力市场一个关键嘅应用呢，就系、是、预测性嘅维护。咁今日我哋会讲几个例子。好啦，咁呢个持续监控同埋分析能源资产嘅效能呢，系非常之重要嘅。咁亦都呢。最紧要就系要事先识别到潜在嘅故障，咁维护通常咧系定期进行啦。咁例如输电线路上嘅电线杆咧，可以喺预定嘅期限里面去检查一次，并且咧根据需要咧进行维修嘅。咁如果你维护发生得太早或者系更严重嘅话，太迟嘅话咧。呢種一刀切嘅方法呢，可能都會導致整體嘅效率低下、哦。喎。為咗解決呢個問題呢一系列嘅公用事業公司呢，正在開發人工智能嘅方案，以幫助監控實體嘅資產，並且使用過去嘅效能同埋中斷數據嚟預測乜嘢時候需要介入。例如，公用事业公司 EON 开发咗一种机器学习演算法，嚟预测咩时候需要更换电网中嘅中压电缆，使用嚟自各方来源嘅数据咧，嚟识别发电模式，并且标记任何不一致之处。咁 EON 嘅研究表明，与传统嘅方法相比咧。预测性维护可以将电网停电减少高达百分之三十。同样，二零一九年，意大利公用事业公司 ENEL 开始喺电力线上安装检测器嚟监测震动水平。机器学习演算法令到 ENEL。能够从结果资料中识别潜在问题，并找出导致呢啲问题嘅原因。因此 ，ENEL 能够将呢啲电缆嘅停电次数减少百分之十五。同样，爱沙尼亚科技新创公司 HEPTA h e p t a Airborne 使用机器。学习平台同埋无人机拍摄嘅输电线路镜头嚟识别缺陷。中国国家电网公司广泛使用人工智能嚟进行诸如分析智慧电网、智慧电标嘅资料，以识别客户設備问题方面，以便进行维修。未来几年，人工智能喺电力系统中嘅潜在用途可能系会大幅增加嘅。除咗更好咁样预测能源供应同埋需求，以及实体资产嘅预测性维护之外咧，应用咧仲好可能会包括第一，管理同埋控制电网，使用来自检测器。智慧电表同埋其他物联网設備嘅一系列数据嚟观察同埋控制网路中嘅电力流动，特别系喺配电层面。第二，使用预测电价、调度同埋控制响应负载以及設定动态定价等一系列。流程嚟到促进需求嘅响应。第三，例如提供改进或扩展嘅消费者服务，喺应用程式同埋线上聊天机器人中使用人工智能或者系机器学习流程咧，嚟改善客户嘅计费体验。咁 Octopus Energy 同埋 Oracle Utilities。
，呢啲公司呢已经系探索紧呢一点啦。AI help prevent great failure, increasing reliability and security. A key AI application is predictive maintenance, where the performance of energy assets is continuously monitored and analyzed to identify potential faults ahead of time. Maintenance typically happens on a regular schedule. Poles on a transmission line, for example, might be examined once within a predefined period and repairs carried out as needed. This one-size-fits-all approach can lead to inefficiencies if maintenance happens too early or, more problematically, too late. To address this, a range of utilities are developing AI-enabled schemes to help monitor physical assets and use past data on performance and outages to predict when intervention is required. Utilities. Company EON, for example, has developed a machine learning algorithm to predict when medium voltage cables in the grid need to be replaced, using data from a range of sources to identify patterns in electricity generation and flag any inconsistencies. EON research suggests that predictive maintenance could reduce outages in the grid. By up to thirty percent, compare with a conventional approach. Similarly, in 2019, Italy-based utility ENEL began installing sensors on power lines to monitor vibration levels. Machine learning algorithms allow ENEL to identify potential problems from the resulting data and discern what caused them. As a result, ENEL has been able to reduce the number of power outages on these cables by 15 percent. Meanwhile, Estonian technology startup Hepta Airborne uses a machine learning platform with drone footage of transmission lines to identify defects, and State Grid Corporation of China uses AI extensively to carry out action such as analyzing data from smart meters to identify problems with customers' equipment. Potential uses for AI across power systems are likely to soar in the years to come, in addition to better forecasting of energy supply and demand and predictive maintenance of physical asset. Application could include managing and controlling grids using an array of data from sensors, smart meters, and other Internet of Things devices to observe and control the flow of power in the network, particularly at the distribution level. Number two, facilitating demand response. Using a range of processes such as forecasting electricity prices, scheduling and controlling response loads, and setting at static dynamic pricing, providing improved or expanded consumer services, using AI or machine learning processes in apps and online chatbots to better customer billing experience. For example, firms such as Octopus Energy. And Oracle Utilities are already exploring this.